When we came to the Earth 50 years ago, humans were traveling into space for the first time. Back then, they were busy taking selfies with their national flags. What's happening on the Earth now that we've come back here after 50 years? Now humans are sending far more satellites and rockets into space than before. You didn't know that? It seems these days everybody on the Earth is launching satellites and going to space. Is it that easy for them to fly into space now? It's a new space era. Humans have developed advanced rocket technologies so they can travel to space more easily now. That's why the number of satellites has increased so much in recent years. And it looks like the number is only going to get bigger in the future. I see. But why do humans keep sending up satellites? They use the satellites for television and phone signals, as well as capturing images to monitor and study what's happening on the Earth. They can observe large areas at once from space using the satellites. Using satellite images, humans can have a bird's eye view of large areas and monitor all kinds of things happening on the Earth. For example, they can use satellites to easily and quickly monitor the urban development as well as disasters such as changes in marine ecosystems. Many companies are out there to receive and process satellite data and provide practical help. Space companies? Contact is one of them. It is in South Korea. Contact has ground stations set up all over the world so we can communicate with satellites and deliver satellite data services. Using ground stations, Contact receives satellite data and turns them into images. Those images make it possible to directly monitor what is happening on the Earth. Contact's ground stations have huge antennas like this. They serve to connect satellites, rockets, and landers in space with the Earth. Without ground stations, we can't keep satellites, rockets, and landers in their target orbits. Also, we can't receive and utilize data from space. This is where Contact's ground station is located. To receive a larger volume of space data and use them properly in the future, it is essential to set up more ground stations all over the world and receive space data more quickly. So it is similar to how I communicate with our home planet? That's right! How smart you are! Great! So if we want to get help from people on the Earth, we should work with Contact! That's right, Debra! And stop making trouble! What? Ugh. Guys, stop! Now, let's gather to celebrate! We are working with contact! One, One two, three, new space!